Hello again, human beings from the planet Earth. I ran across another horrible headline that I thought uh, I could use to wake you up a little bit. And uh, certainly woke me up a little bit. Uranium eating bacteria to clean up radioactive sites. When I saw this in my inbox, I immediately think of Corexic and the hell that that has caused, uh, you know, bacteria that eats oil. So I can only fucking imagine what a uranium eating bacteria would do. But let's read and we'll pick it apart as we go, shall we? The link will be below so you can go back and read it without my commentary if you wish. A uh, ranger mine, a uranium mine in Kakadu National Park, Australia. Uh, it's coming out of Sydney. Some bacteria have the capacity to stabil stabilize uranium contaminated sites and if they are used, they could reduce the chances of these sites contaminating major waterways and ecosystems, U.S. scientists have said. Of the millions of tons of bacteria living within the Earth's subsurface, some are able to transform the oxidative state of uranium, which defines how the element will interact with oxygen to form various molecules. They change it from radioactive, toxic, and water-soluble uranium-6 to the less soluble, stationary, and therefore less harmful uranium-4 as part of their normal growth. While this process is relatively well known and has been demonstrated numerous times, until now most studies have occurred in the lab without the added difficulties associated with working in the field, namely that uranium isn't the only element that the bacteria affects. So let's think about this much. Okay, we've got mad scientists again from the United States fucking with bacteria in a lab. Uh, you know, bacteria in uranium. Two wonderful things to put together, right? Okay, that's what I'm thinking. And again, for you trolls, I have no scientific background, so go ahead and shoot your slander. Uh, I can only give you common sense, or what I see is common sense. But I don't think you fuck with bacteria in a lab, and I don't think you fuck with uranium. I don't think any good comes of it. Prove me wrong. Anyway, uh, bacteria cause chemical changes in several elements, including iron and sulfur, says Ken Kemner, a physicist with the U United States Department of Energy Argonne National Laboratory, which is conducting the research. These changes in the iron and or sulfur geochemistry could cause uranium to change between soluble and insoluble forms. Could cause the uranium to change. There's no proof, evidently. He said could cause. So we're just throwing shit out there and we don't know what the fuck's going to happen. Anyway, continuing on. The Argonne scientists are studying bacteria at three uranium contaminated research sites across the United States. One in Colorado and two others at the Pacific Northwest and Oak Ridge National Laboratories in Washington State and Tennessee respectively. All are relics of the nuclear proliferation of the Cold War with the potential for contaminating major waterways. Let me repeat that. All are relics of the nuclear proliferation of the Cold War era with the potential for contaminating major waterways. Again, that was three in the United States on the verge of contaminating major waterways. And so, to recap, we're going to throw fucking bacteria that we're not really sure what it does, but we think that it could, and it might just, and we're going to throw that in there, uh, what, to ensure that the waterway is contained? I, I don't, I don't know. Um, I, I don't think you fuck with uranium, and I don't think you fuck with bacteria in a lab. I, I don't think any good is going to come of this. Uh, so that's a big heads up. Uh, and I don't think most of us knew that there were three uranium contaminated sites in the United States that are on the verge of contaminating major waterways. I, I don't think most of us knew that. Uh, good Lord. Hell on Earth. 2012. That's what's going on here. All right, anyway, you want to read the rest of this nonsense, the link will be below, but big heads up. More mad science. More nuclear wastes uh, spewing out everywhere. And, and we're going to fix it in a lab, even though we're not really sure what the fuck we're doing or what the result of it will be. Anyway, much love, stay safe.